Every Tuesday in our Don't Be a Victim Report, we bring you important information about how to stay safe. And it's not just adults who need to be on guard. Tonight, Russ Riesinger shows us just how many young people are learning to protect themselves and also gain confidence through martial arts. But first, I want to use my what? Hey. My brain and my voice and my eyes to avoid any problems. Right, guys? Sir. Well, I mean, if you look at the news almost any night, I mean, you know, kids are getting bullied, kids are getting abducted by other people, and what our program really does is kind of builds kids from the inside out. And we're really trying to teach kids, you know, to be able to stand up for themselves. We also want them to stand up for others, and we want them to stand up for what's right. You can find these kids yeah. getting their kicks at the ATA Black Belt Academy in Savannah. Instructor Jerome Murray says the earlier they start, the better they generally learn. At a younger age, we'll be able to kind of influence them to do the right thing and how to use that stuff not only to protect themselves, but to protect their families if they need to. I think it would help me have an edge because I know a lot more than they know about fighting and self-defense. How about that one, guys? And students say they're having fun at the same time. But I like doing it just because it makes me feel kind of happy. And it, and it caught me fit because I used to be kind of fat. Now I have, like, really strong abs. Um, it would probably help me out because I just um, I feel really confident about it. And plus, I probably will get, would get more bullied more than more people because of my hand. Um, I was born this way. Mm. Yeah. But I feel fine about it. I think that even with my hand, I could probably protect myself. Yeah. I, I feel confident about that kind of stuff. Gaining that confidence is one of the great benefits of learning martial arts, according to these instructors. But ironically, they hope their students never have to put their self-defense skills to use. We kind of hope that they never need it, but we'd rather if they do need it, that they've got it. In Savannah, Russ Riesinger, WTOC News. For more information on the ATA Black Belt Academy Kids programs or self-defense programs for adults, you can give them a call. We have that number on our website, WTOC.com.